Big time matchup. I think it's time for uh, Little Stars Network comes to IWTV, perhaps. Well, well, well. Brady Pierce, Jay Spade. Hey, what is... Jay Spade looks like, uh... He's eyeballing one of those kids in like the third row. That was about. All right. Spade brought the, you know what? That's a good pro tip there. What is it? With that bottle, but you're really supposed to do it in the back. Oh. You don't usually see it in the ring. Hey, so it's for the people. Great beat. It was a Rick Ross beat, and then it was a little Wayne beat, too. That's how good that beat was. <laughs> Professional wrestlers in their own right. You may know them from uh, the Star Show Heels, which I believe is I believe season two be coming pretty quick. You can check out season one over on the Stars Network. Do it. Action CEO Matt Griffin was a part of season one as well. Twice episodes. I hope they didn't let him get a sad card, but that's a conversation for another time. That is a conversation for another time. Luke Hawks is a extremely, extremely skilled veteran and a veteran from, with a, well, I should say from, but with a Georgia wrestling background, a big part of that Cornelia wrestling heritage and tradition, that wild side wrestling heritage. So no stranger to Georgia wrestling, of course, heels is filmed here in this area. So, ooh. I cannot wait for season two. Luke and PJ uh, holding court here. Brady Pierce is trying to fight three children. Yep, taking a page out of Liam Gray's book. We'll see Liam Gray later tonight. But, uh. Referee Gina Lani's going to have her hands full with this, I think. <laughs> I was just thinking the same. Everybody be cool. Just let the bell ring. Well, we got to get one in yeah, and one out for each team right away. I think, you know, Hawks Airy, Luke, Luke and PJ sort of holding court there. They wanted to dominate the moment in the ring. And it uh, looks like PJ and Jay Spade will be starting things out here. We've got our bell match underway. The Hollywood Heels team of Brady Pierce and Jay Spade. Taking on Hawks A. Luke Hawks there on the apron. Firing things up. PJ in the ring. Representing that wild cat wrestling school and tradition out of New Orleans as well. PJ. Well, I mean, that's an impressive takedown by Jay Spade. I mean, that, like, he, well, all right. I don't know if that was that. He was. Maybe he was the miss? I don't know. Jay Spade, uh, very sure of himself most. Very confident guy. Yeah. You know what, though? I've said this many times. It, there's a line between confidence and cocky. There is. But being confident is a major part of being a successful pro wrestler. So 
That's not necessarily a bad thing as long as you don't cross that line into cockiness. That, then you get in trouble. Look at that, nice side headlock, reversal. PJ scrambling there, amateur style, floats over. Go. Had almost a quarter Nelson into a cover there. Now he's working out of a waist slot, trying to get, trying to maybe smother him, make him carry that weight. Able to float through into a, yeah, look at that. You gotta be careful. PJ Hawks gotta be careful. He's gotta pull him back out of that corner. Able to do so, big takedown. Burley boy. Little tip for tad action early on, those. PJ Hawks, of course, uh, Twitter famous a couple years back for diving out of a balcony in a mall. Tight, so, very tight. That is, explosive might be an understatement here. Spade and PJ still the tar right. I mean, no. That's legal, but not necessarily sportsmanlike. Almost got him on the trip. Oh, wow, that was real close. Still going. PJ rolled through, great counter, up and over, lands on his feet. Changing speeds here. Woo, buddy. Oh. Got that arm drag. Let's go. How about one more? And a big top drop kick. Pinpoint accuracy. And Spade skipped across that canvas like a rock across a pond. Yeah, we're gonna attack. We're and the Hawks, attack. Are, they're dominating this thing so far. Having a blast doing it, too. Brady Pierce is a big dude, man. That's a big guy. I, I've seen this guy on the independent scene for a long time. He's, he's experienced, he's got some size. Oh. Calling in the big guns. What's this? Asking for a minute, okay. Oof. Yeah. That's some shoot sweat. Well, what about that? It's a shoving contest. Ah, just a cheap shot from Brady Pierce. And Pierce following up with some big shots here for a headlock. Trying to get a good grip on his hands there, you'll notice. Yep. Trying to grip him as tight as he can. Hawks to his credit, trying to counter that grip. Still fighting. Hawks trying to use these ropes to his advantage here, able to break it. Man, that size of Pierce, major factor there. Side headlock takeover. Out of down on the counter. You notice, that's really, that's really, that's a sign of a very good wrestler. Luke Hawks immediately pushed off. Doesn't even want those shoulders to be down. You can be defeated in a pending combination if you're not careful. We've seen that We've happen. Seen More inexperienced wrestlers. Luke Hawks, the man for 20 years. Oh, it goes to the, come on. Yeah, he was not gonna allow that, but. See the advantage he can get. Ah, power slam! The snap on that, drop kick. drop kick! I don't know if he could see all the way, Dylan, but he's reconnecting. All right, look to me. Yeah, he can't see all the way. He can't see, oh, look at that! Might have been playing a little possum there. The vet move. And, oh, if we, if we start seeing some in and out tags, that could be a, a change, game changer here. Now Jace Bull, trapped, up and down, Ooh. double back breaker! PJ trying to fight and keep up. He knew what PJ was trying to do there. He's still running up for the win, but. PJ really, I've noticed this, he really likes this waist slot yes. from a down position. And I actually like it too. I think tactically there's a lot you can do with this. It's something that wrestlers don't often see, which makes it harder to defend against. Bates trying to get, got an inside leg trip. And oh, come on. Yeah, that connected flush. Well. That was questionable legality there. He's in the ropes. And he's in, yeah, there we go. Great, yeah. That's good officiating. Right on top of things there. Right here, right here. 
Using that big boot again. And this is, I wondered when we were going to see the isolation. That's usually when tag team, come on! And Pierce just knocked Luke off the apron. And I, I wondered when we were going to see this, when we were going to see the ring cut off and the in and out tag. That's one thing, that's legal. But, but, uh, choking somebody, I mean. Pierce bringing PJ back to the corner, wants to keep him as far away from Luke as possible. The young gun going to the body fight, but he's taking a lot of punishment. Getting a couple of those huge boots already. Looks like, man, he hit that turnbuckle super hard. Shifted the ring a little bit. His bait follows up. Oh, yeah. Got all of it. And back in, up and over. Are you kidding me? Are you kidding me with that? Oh, oh yeah, cut. Two. And Pierce was drawn with the crowd. He wouldn't have been able to make that save. This place would have went completely nuts. And Luke is dying to get back in that. Wants that tag so bad. Oh, 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 Pierce was almost caught sleeping on the job there. Love the fight. He was almost caught sleeping on the job. PJ is, yeah, see, every time I think he's gonna get himself in an effective position to even make a lunge, he is unable to do so. Only a two. Almost did. Only a two. Luke again trying to get just some energy going because he can feel just like the rest of us. Only so much more can be done, man. PJ has taken a beating. He's fighting though up to a knee now, back up to his feet. Using the hair. Every corner they can cut, every single one. Man, the Hollywood Hills have been, you know, they've been in total control of this ever since. Yep. PJ got caught up on the ropes yep. on that trip, on, and Brady Pierce kicked him in the head. Come on, come on. It's been a totally different match. Well executed suplex into a quick cover. Two. Man, I, I don't know. That might have been it. I mean, if, if Luke Hawk got coming to make the save, that might have been the end of this one. Yeah, PJ just looking around like he wasn't even sure where he was. And where he is is a long way from where he wants to be. What's he going for here? He's gonna power bomb him, maybe? He is. Oh, oh he's got him all the way up. Oh, PJ! Oh, I, I'm, not, she, I'm not sure Gina saw the tag. I'm not sure the official saw the tag here. She didn't. Absolutely uh, not. You know, look, we, you can't put that on her. The reality is, this is why I always say, you really need a second official for tag team matches because of this kind of garbage. And the Hollywood Heels, this is for you, Luke. living up to their, their moniker here, and I don't mean the uh, mm. back part of their boots. Nope. JN now. They're in and out with these tags, cutting off the ring, maximizing the damage. Oh, air ball! Uh, come on, that's the second, maybe the third time even, that Luke's been knocked off that apron. The numbers advantage all the way in the Hollywood Hills fail. Oh! PJ. PJ trying to fight through this. Big leg, Larry turns right in there. Got the tag. Turned right into it. Here comes Luke, and he's ticked off. Oh. Big wheel kick. Snap. Oh, Pierce again. In my opinion, that's a size thing there that helped him out, but no! Trapped him on that neck breaker variation! Dead center! Two! And that wheel kick was 
gnarly. Got all of it. There's now got a gut wrench position here. All the way up. He's got a tag. And Lucas, he's hurt. To the knees. Here's where the boot floats right into a cover. He's able to break it up, but he's sustained a lot of damage in this match mode. He absolutely has. I mean, he's fighting, and you got to respect that. Of oh, grit. True grit. And I think there was another blind tag. I think there was another blind tag. Loop back up. Lands that, and we. What's again? We got a tag to PJ. Big spine buster, but PJ's legal. Got him. PJ's legal with a crossbody. One, two, three. PJ has his go. I don't think he has any clue he won. Did I win? You won. He won. He had no idea. And that was an extremely well executed cover. He, if you notice, he went right into a cradle there, Mose. And, and showing right now the wares of it. I'm not sure if he knew what he was doing. That's just muscle memory. That's just knowing what you're doing in the squared circle. What an impressive finish. What a great win. Should I heal? Big thank you to Heels. Hold on a second. I want y'all to hear this. Everybody in the building, I want y'all to hear this. First off, I'd like to thank you for having us here for our first night in action wrestling in Newton, Georgia. My son and I are from New Orleans, Louisiana. Last year, we moved to Newton, Georgia to film a little TV show on Star Network named Heels. Right now, we're shooting season two. We had an awesome first season. We got an action-packed second season. We're coming back. Who's very special to me? She's very special. 